What's happening everybody, 3G Geek here, and I wanted to go on a small little rant today. Uh, for those of you who have never played Overwatch, uh, it is a hero-based uh, multiplayer that you compete against one another for either to control a point or to push a package along a, spe a specified route. Uh, but either way, if you don't know what Overwatch is and you've been living under a rock, there are plenty of videos who uh, that are able to explain it better than I can in just a few short minutes. But the rant that I want to go on real quick has to do with the matchmaking system in Overwatch. I don't know if you've experienced this or not, but your team that you've been placed on seems seems extremely lower than the team that you're matched up against like there have been a lot of games where it's like me and my girlfriend and my friends were just playing overwatch and we're all at least bronze level and me and my girlfriend both have a both have one star and my friends are working to get their first star and then we're matched up against a whole bunch of silver level people that have multiple stars or even gold level people or even people who are bronze but still have like four or five stars so to me, it doesn't really make any sense. Like, it seem it seems like a weird matchmaking system where you have these people who are who have played so much more Overwatch than us and are getting matched up against us. And so I don't know if it's broken. I heard somewhere or read somewhere that the matchmaking system is also based on your last couple of games if you've won them or not. Um, that like ups your ups the people that you play against. I don't know if that's just a thing or if I'm just <laughs> being overly sensitive to whom I'm playing against when we lose. I honestly don't know. Um, so that's just the small rant I wanted to go on. Another thing that I've noticed that I'm just kind of curious about, and I'd like to hear if anyone like knows of something like this. I don't know if there is like an Overwatch influencer or an Overwatch. Uh, player that has that like gets a lot of content out there about Overwatch that uh, influences people to play as a certain character because it seems like it fluctuates where there's one character that just kind of bursts into the scene where they are at least in every match either on my team or the opposing team or both a while ago it was Symmetra and more recently it has been Widowmaker and I'm sure in a little while it's going to change again. So I don't know if like there's someone that like, plays these characters and then everyone thinks like oh I need to go play this character or something like that. I'm not saying it's a bad thing, it's just something that has also caught my eye and it's not really a part of the rant, but I just thought I would mention it. So either way, I uh, just wanted to get this quick rant off of my chest and just wanted to see what you guys thought about it. Uh, if you have experienced this and you have similar questions, please leave any ideas, thoughts, or comments down below. And also feel free to like this video and also subscribe and ring that little bell so you know when I post new videos. But either way, this is 3G Geek, signing off.